My vision for the OpenMiska project is that it's going to become a significant producer of copper and gold and it's going to revitalize the whole community of Chape with the surrounding area. The camp here in, in Chape was started back in the late 20s. It was only when the uh, Quebec government opened up a, a road that the project became economic. The important thing was the grade was quite high, it was about 2.5% uh, copper with about 1.5% copper cutoff. What makes this project special is that we recognize that because of that cutoff grade that they had, they left a lot of material behind and uh, we've been exploring all of this low-grade material that surround these veins and it's allowing us to define some open pit uh, style material. We have 104 million tons at 0.85% copper equivalent in our resource and we think we can improve that. What I'm doing now with QC Copper as VP Exploration, moving this thing forward is I consider this to be something I've been preparing for all my professional career. We have a railroad that comes up to the door of the mine, a very high-powered electrical transmission line that goes right through the property. There's a very large substation in uh, right on the property, and we have a local community that is supportive of mining. For the people of Chappé, to bring a new source with a new miner, it's something that is very positive. C'est quelque chose qui encourage beaucoup les gens et qui leur donne euh, un peu son, son vœu, une lueur d'espoir pour la, la prospérité de la ville. This is going to be a new mine, a modern mine. It's going to be developed using state-of-the-art technologies. It's going to be focused on carbon neutrality, a project that everybody in Chappé and the whole region is going to be proud of. Le développement minier à Chappé va être plus que bienvenu. Chappé est une ville minière. Chapé a été créé par et pour les mines. What, what makes Open Miska special is uh, infrastructure, its people, and its jurisdiction. And uh, those three together make the Open Miska project probably one of the most exciting projects in Canada at this time.